Hello and welcome to another update video about AVEX. AVEX is currently following um, the projected wave count in that we were still watching for another high in this um, C wave of a wave five. The bigger picture, we talked about that in the last few days, obviously tracking here a potential C wave to the upside, which is a five wave move of the um, October lows. Yeah. <clears throat> so the idea is that this is an ending diagonal and that we completed here a B wave of a wave five recently. And we're now moving up in wave C of wave five. Um, that's at least at the moment, the interpretation, the focus at the moment is still on higher prices until we break below micro support. That's at the moment at $23.63. Also, looking at the microstructure, it would suggest that we still need another 4-5 pattern. Or let me rephrase it. The whole structure would, would look better with another 4-5 section. Um, that would be here the idea that we complete this small third wave, get another dip possibly into the support area, and then one more high. Um, what I mentioned to you before was that this area starting at $29.30 is a key target, or actually the $29.30 level itself, is a key target for this A wave. Uh, the reasons we discussed in previous videos, an A wave of a larger degree, wave two, which is the current rally, oftentimes reaches the 38.2 retracement, which this level is at $29. Also, it's a previous swing high uh, that was made in August 22, quite a substantial and well, uh, well, um, you know, at least it jumps into your face on the chart, right? Those often make good resistance levels. And then also if we measure the length of the A wave, then the length of the C wave projects to the 1.618 extension if it hits the $29 level. So, you know, there are various variables pointing to the $29 level, $29.30 dollars. Um, okay, does it need to stop there? No, it doesn't need to stop there, but it's been our target for the last few weeks. Maybe, no, not months, maybe not months, but weeks. And um, it's just sort of the f like, a, like a reliable, let's say more or less reliable target for an A wave. It's really the only thing we had. In addition to that, um, you need to understand, but also mentioned that before, that an A wave can reach the 50% Fibonacci level as well. You sometimes see these, that would be here, and that's around the $40 mark. So what I'm doing, I'm going to watch four reactions to $29.30. I would be surprised if we just go through there straight away, but you know, anything is possible, we're in crypto. Um, but typically you would expect a bit of a reaction there. I mean, there are several levels that come together at that $29 level. Um, but yeah, I will not rule out that the A wave also reaches $40, especially as long as the relevant micro support levels are holding. Not much more to add, just want to give you a quick update as we're getting closer to the target. And to be honest, it seems like <clears throat> it seems like that AVEX wants to get there. Yeah. Um, maybe just an, just one more comment that it seems like we're still in this small third, which again is also a five wave move. And we had here possibly a wave one a wave two, a wave three, a wave four, and a wave five. The microstructure is a little bit difficult to read. That's generally um, a characteristic of altcoins. So we always have to be a little bit um, cautious, but overall it's going according to plan. I hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.